End game point guard Nikola Jokic. End game point guard Nikola Jokic. End game dark matter Nikola Jokic is the level 40 reward in season 8 in NBA 2K22 my team. But before we get into this video, if you guys if you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe. And if you guys enjoy my team content, this is the place to be. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So end game point guard Jokic, 99 offense, 99 on defense. He's a six foot eleven freaking point guard with every Hall of Fame badge in the game. Basically, every 99 stat in the game. Um, he's all in all this card. All in all, this card is going to be a dub by 2K because he's a free end game for level 40, and he can run a 6'11 point guard in my team. I mean, I get we have tons of tall point guards in my team, but I think end game Jokic is probably like he's probably up there with the best point guards in my team just because he's an end game. He's up there with the best point guards in my team. So there he is. We all know hot zones everywhere. He has quick drops off one, which is really the best dunk package in all of my team. Jumper is nice. I really like his jumper. Um, he'll never get blocked in those dunks, like I said. He has a great behind the back, which is a he has a Scotty behind the back, which is really great for Nikola for Nikola Jokic. I mean, it makes him. I mean, out of that Scotty behind the back burst, it makes him look like. I mean, it makes him look like a lot faster in game. Like coming out of that sky sky pivot behind the back. I mean, end game Jokic is no joke. I mean, if you are very close to level 40, I would I would just go ahead and just get him at this point in the game, just because he's a free end game at the end of the day. He is gonna be so much worth the time and the grind. I mean, I get some people don't like this card, but. I think I'm, I think I personally will like him just because he's a tall point guard, and plus if you don't want to run my point guard, you can run my center. Like we're normal, you can run him at his normal position, which is center. So basically, if you don't want my point guard, run him at center. I mean, some people might, some people might like running him at center instead of the point guard position. I mean, me personally, I'm gonna run him at point guard just because I want a tall point guard in my lineup. I mean, I mean, he's free at the end of the day. He's a very tall point guard at almost seven feet tall. Um, I mean, if you want, like, an endgame point guard like Durant, LeBron, Jordan, Ben Simmons, or, like, out of position Yao Ming, I mean, or n the new Kristaps Porzingis out of position that just came out, be my guest, go get one of those, but those cards are actually pretty expensive. I mean, I get this is going to be, like, a longer grind to do because you need to get level 40 to get this card, but... For me personally, Endgame Jokic is the way to go. Because this season in my team is the easiest way, in my opinion, to get XP. This is the easiest season in my team to get XP. It's so easy because literally every Tuesday and Friday and Wednesday, they literally drop like 2,000 to, to like 3,000 XP each for every player to like compete, like to use. Like drop 90 points in multiple games with any player. 3,000 XP. It's so easy just to get XP this year. This season, my team. I mean, so if you don't have the Jokic card and you're very close to getting him, or like you're halfway there, I I would just say continue the grind and just get this card. Because no matter what, I think personally you guys would like, you would love this Nikola Jokic because he's he's a tall point guard and he can basically run your offense. You can basically like run your offense through him. So yeah, now this is going green and three. There we go. Now we're gonna hit the triple threat game. Personally, run him. He's still gonna carry your offense. So we're going up against Pink Diamond out of position, Jimmy Butler, Dynamic Rating, Kyrie, and Galaxy Opal, Duncan Robinson. Oh god, just imagine Kyrie Irving on Nikola Jokic in this game. I can just literally use my size advantage just to lock him, just to post him down to the paint. Oh boy. And I no, I don't think he's on him. Okay, well Duncan Robinson's not gonna be really a matchup for him for him. Good defense by Jordan. Kyrie Irving stands no chance going up against zero gravity MJ. And he's and I'm sorry, Jimmy Butler. I'm a diehard Heat fan, but you're not gonna match up with Manu Bull either. 
Look at that. Back to back blocks for for Jordan. Just body him down. You can't. That's too easy for Jokic. That's way too easy for Nikola Jokic. Come on now. Oh yeah, and Jordan. Good defense. A third block for MJ. A pull oh, up. Oh, oh. oh my Green gosh, Giants. Nikola Jokic. And now he has sharp take two. Both Jordan and Nikola Jokic had sharp shooting takeover. Let's go. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, Duncan. You're not gonna you're not gonna score a point on Nikola Jokic. I'm just sorry. You're not you're not gonna score a point. And if you do, then I'm sorry. That's just bad defense on my part then. Oh, look at this! I mean, look at this. They can't get a clean shot. Everything else, they, everything they take is contested. Never mind. I just, Butler just bumps on Jokic. That's fine. Back into the same thing. First, to the back. pass it into Jordan. Easy layup there for Jordan. And good pass too by Jokic. Let's go. Jordan's going ham on the defensive end. Let's go. Iso, give me an Iso. I want this. I want this dance with Kyrie. Whoop! Burst to the basket. <laughs> oh, he just made Urban look silly. Oh, Kyrie. Kyrie, Kyrie. I'm sorry I had to do that to you. I'm so sorry. Good block there by Bull, and good steal there by Jordan. Pass to Jokic, pull for three in transition in Butler's face. No chance, but free, no free board. No chance, free board there for Bull. Let's go, run Jokic. Oh, damn, okay, Duncan Robinson, I see you. Okay. Wow, Duncan Robinson is actually the actually a pretty good defender, but they still can't buy a bucket on the other end. So as long as they miss, we're fine. Oh ho! ho. Oh yeah, Nikola Jokic! What a post fadeaway! I see you, Jokic. Bro, look at this. He has nowhere to go. He has nowhere. Okay. That's just bad defense on my part. What the? See, Duncan Robinson is just like locking me up on the defensive end. I mean, I get I have like nine points with Jokic, but Duncan Robinson is doing his thing on the, on the defensive end. I'm telling you. Come on, Bull. Lock up Butler. No chance. Free board there for Bull. Let's go. Find Jokic behind the back. Pass the, pass the ball. Wide open midi for Bull. Let's go. Good pass there from Jokic. Let's go. Great great team chemistry. Let's go. Keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Bro. Kyrie can't get an open look for nothing. No, pass it in. Pass it to Jordan. Bro. No matter if it's good defense or not, Jordan's still going to find a way to finish. If it's, good, if it's good defense or not, it's Jordan. You're not going to stop him no matter what. Bro. <laughs> this is just unfair. This is what this is unfair. What Jordan's doing? I think he already has like five blocks or something. And Butler, I think I think Butler has all their points. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, I think Butler has all their points. I want to shoot in. His, I want to shoot in his face. Good block there from Bull. This is just not fair. There's too much height on this team. Jordan at 6'6, six, six, Manu Bull at 7'6, and, and freaking Jokic at 6'11. There's so much height on this team. I mean, everyone's over 6'5. That's. That's a bad shot. Ah! Alright, now I'm getting a little bit too cocky here. But Jokic is just putting on a defensive clinic. Everyone on this team is putting up a defensive clinic because no one can score on this team. 
ho, ho, ho. Oh, Jordan right in, right in Jimmy Bucket's face. Let's go. Jimmy Butler can't stand a chance with Jordan. Wow, Jordan just... Everyone on this team is going off this game. I mean, no one's having a bad game. Everyone else is having a great game. I mean, Jordan, has, I think he has like six blocks. What the hell is happening? And then Jokic on the other end. Wow, 44% contested. Jokic is just... He's going off. Everyone on this team is going off. I mean... And there's... I was say, there's another block for Jordan, but never mind. But he still missed. Oh, give me an, okay, give me an isolation. Just give me an iso. Never mind, I'm pulling, I'm pulling up from here. Wide open! Okay, I missed. They still can't- Duncan still can't buy a bucket. I think Butler's all their points. Ho, ho, ho. Green Dancing! Holy crap, what a game for this whole squad. I mean, everybody had a great game. I can't just give it to Jokic. I gotta give it to Jordan and Manupo. They all did their thing on, on the defensive side of the ball. Oh my goodness. I mean, if you take if we check the box score right here, I mean, Jokic, 14 points, 4 assists, and a block. Jordan, 7 points, 3 boards, 1 steal, and 5 blocks. Manu Bull, 2 points, 8 rebounds, 2 assists, and 3 blocks. No one had a, no, no one, I can't just give this, I can't just give this performance to Jokic. I gotta give this performance to every single one of my players. They did their, they did their thing on the court. Holy crap, that was one hell of a game for my squad. To be honest, I think that might be like my best overall performance with my whole squad. Because normally when I do gameplay videos, I just run through one player that I'm doing the gameplay on. But, but for this gameplay, I actually ran through the whole team. So that was, a, that was a really collective W by the whole squad. I like that W, bro. I mean, if you guys don't have Jokic... I would say get this card if you're almost there or at least halfway there. Cause you still have you still have plenty of time left in this season to get Jokic. He's a hell of a card. And if you want a top point guard and that's an end game and he's free, go get Nikola Jokic. He is definitely worth the grind. Trust me on that. So let's open the vault and let's see if it opens. It does not open. Okay, the vault never opens anymore on 2K. So yeah, that's pretty much the video. So endgame Nikola Jokic point guard. Like I said, if you're halfway there or at least almost there, don't stop the grind. Go get this card. No matter what you do, it's gonna be worth the it's gonna be worth the grind. Trust me. You guys, you guys have plenty of time left in the season to get this card. He is very much worth the grind, and I would highly recommend you guys run this card at point guard because he is a glitch at point guard, but. If you don't want to run him there, run him at center. No matter where, he, no matter where you run him, he's gonna be an overpowered card, no matter what. And if you haven't already, like and subscribe. And peace.